All right, the first thing we're going to talk about is the new template choose system that we've integrated in V5. So we'll go over to design and we'll click on choose template. And here's the new template chooser. Pretty simple here. My templates tells you what you have installed and Volusion templates tell you all the templates that you can install. Just click over here and we can go back. So we're going to go ahead and install another template onto this store. We're going to click on, let's say, vpeach. And then we're going to click on install here. And now we see vpeach right here in the list. And you see up here it says your template has been installed but will not be live until you click the publish. You can either click publish or preview to see what this template is going to look like. So let's click on preview and it will pop it open a new window and we can see here the new template in place. Our preview page. So I liked it. Let's go ahead and publish it and make it live. So we'll click on publish and you'll see that that warning disappeared and if we go to the front of the store and refresh we have a new template here. Now you may be wondering where the text title go. Well the text title is what we're going to be talking about next. But let's go back to the template chooser real quick and let me show you some other things you can do here. Now let's say you were editing this like if you're watching the advanced design video and you were editing the HTML and you realize you screwed up and you want to go back well, instead of having to call tech support now to refresh your store, all you have to do is click on the template again and click on reinstall. So let's say we screwed up vpeach. We'll just click on Volusion templates, click on vpeach, and a reinstall button will appear here. We just click on reinstall and just click OK on this. And now we'll get a fresh new install of vpeach. So that's some of the things you can do with the choose template. We'll go over this duplicate this template part in the advanced design video because that's what it's really used for. And in the next section we're going to talk about my logos or what you used to call in V4 branding images. All right, let's talk about the my logos section. We'll click on my logos here.